Dear President Biden, 23 years ago, our California coastline full of cliffs, sandy beaches, and rugged terrain was designated a national monument. It was preserved as a haven for surfers, hikers, and nature enthusiasts. I feel very lucky to call it home. But despite protections, our coastlines are still affected by what happens upstream, like pollution, urban development, and climate change. In order to protect our coastline and coastal communities, we must expand our protection inland. Communities across California are calling on you to designate and expand nearly 1 million acres of land as national monuments. Doing so will safeguard sacred tribal lands, help ensure access to the outdoors, and protect our coast downstream. Dear Mr. President, our watersheds are the veins of California, a hidden network of waterways that stretch across our lands. Often, we just turn on the faucet and we don't understand where our water's coming from. This expansion would allow us the place to reconnect, rediscover nature in a way that our urban communities don't get to experience every day through water, wildlife, and biodiversity. Mr. President, for thousands of years, our ancestors have been stewards of these lands, where mountains meet meadows, and waters flow to the heart of our lands and our stories. Many people look at the desert as an area that you know, who can live in a desolate land, but as you can see, there are many resources to live on. This area should be an outdoor classroom for not only Indian tribes, but for local communities. By preserving California's sacred lands as national monuments, we have the opportunity now to protect and safeguard them for future generations. What we decide and preserve today will decide our future. President Biden, please join our movement to protect California's beautiful lands, waterways, and indigenous way of life.